All right, Andrew Bell is with us from B&M Bloomberg. Good morning to you. Uh, I want to follow up on the latest on the Cantra story. That's right. Well, a marijuana grower, of course, under fire for growing cannabis in a room. Uh, and apparently, this we're talking about a big room, about 50,000 square feet, Ooh. not far off the size of a, of a football field, uh, without a license from Health Canada. More documents are coming out. My colleague David George Kosh, uh, looking at documents, minutes of meet a meeting, which indicate that the CEO said, continue as planned. Continue as planned. That may well be his corporate hmm. epitaph and go ahead huh. and plant stuff in that room. So it looks as though the, the smoking gun, to use that awful cliche, huh. is there. Interesting. And what would be the possible follow up follow from this? The whole industry is going to be under scrutiny. Remember, this was thought to be one of the blue chip firms that had tens of thousands of medical patients. The other, uh, they've had to freeze all sales of products. And the other medical, uh, sorry, marijuana companies are said to be in a feeding frenzy. It's like sharks moving in to try to grab their thousands of medical patients. Of course, the serious thing is that those medical customers can't get their product right now. Yeah, that is the key. All right, Andrew, thank you so much for thank being here. Thank you very much. Thanks for watching. If you like this, be sure to subscribe here. And you can check out more Your Morning videos right here.